Hi, it's Molly McDonald for DemoGirl.com. It's Friday, August 20th, 2010, and this is your complimentary tour of Facebook Places and your privacy. Facebook Places allows you to virtually check in to real-life locations and see which of your Facebook friends are nearby. Just open your Facebook app and tap the Places icon. Now I'll see where my Facebook friends have checked into who are using Places. Just tap on the person to see more info. And you can leave comments and like, just like a regular Facebook post. If you tap on info, you'll see how many check-ins this place has. Another thing that you can do is check your friends in. So I'm going to check in where I'm having lunch right now. First, I'll find it from the nearby places. Here it is. And you can also add a what am I doing text. I'm having lunch. Now I can tag friends who are with me or that I know are here. Just scroll through your list of friends and then add them. That's done. And now they're added to the check-in. Tap check-in and that's it, you'll be checked in. So that's the gist of Facebook Places. If you're at Starbucks and your friend is down the street at the other Starbucks and you both check in, then you'll know you're nearby and you can leave and go to a better coffee shop together. Now for the privacy side on Facebook.com. Go to your privacy settings and then look at what you have set for places I check in. It could be set for everyone, friends of friends, friends only, or other. I want to customize mine, so click on Customize Settings and then next to Places I Check Into, choose who you want to see your places check-ins. Now I doubt that you ever want to choose everyone. In fact, the safe choice is to choose only your friends. But the absolute safest choice is to choose Customize and then select Specific People. Just enter in their names and then only these people that I've selected can see my place's check-ins. If you do choose the friends option, then you can add people's names here that you don't want to see your check-ins. And make sure you save your settings. And that's Facebook Places and your privacy in a nutshell. Thanks for watching and we'll see you back at demogirl.com.